Yo, 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 shout out to the whole Angry Fan movement. What up, man? You good? I'm good, my love. I'm breathing. Check it out, B. Battle rap is on fire right now. Leagues are going back and forth being petty. I love it. I'm not going to lie to y'all. I love it. I want the leagues to top each other by having the best cards. That way the fans win because we get nothing but fire battles. You know what I'm saying? Now, my question to y'all is what are you watching tonight? Are you going to watch Chrome 23 cancel Christmas? I believe it's $45. Or are you are going to watch the prelude that URL just announced will be streamed for free on caffeine at the exact same time as Chrome 23? Now, what are my thoughts on that? Was that petty by URL? Of course it was. Of course it was. Am I surprised? No. Why would I be surprised? I've watched them go back and forth with King of the Dot, even though it was kind of respectful because they always over there in Canada so that they wasn't getting like crazy, crazy, right? Then RBE came up and I seen them going back and forth with RBE and it kind of made sense to me. I got to be honest with you because organics in Canada, ARP was in the backyard. He was in New York. He's in Atlanta. He's places that they go. That's more of a direct competition. And on top of that, ARP would take shots at them. They would take subliminals back at him. They felt like he was building his brand off of artists that they've already branded. So it was like a whole lot going on back and forth there. You know what I'm saying? Events the same day, all kind of things. So why would you think they wouldn't be petty with Remy when in their eyes, and I'm only assuming this, and they are, this is how I'm looking at it from the outside looking in. Okay, Remy, you came in the battle rap. You said you're going to have an all-female league. Now, you got to keep also in mind I feel like you are and Queen of the Ring are clicked up the same way I feel like the trenches in Chrome 23 are clicked up. You know what I'm saying? So I kind of feel like when Remy came out, it was more of a Queen of the Ring versus Chrome 23 thing at first. And then Remy started getting the guys. Now you are like, whoa, 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 whoa. That's not what was supposed to happen, even though she has nothing to do with them. You see what I'm saying? Like, like, her, like her card was called, I do what I want. So you are you can't tell her how to move even though that's what she said was going to happen to the point that you even got battle rap females coming out, going at, at uh, Remy Ma because she's booking guys and things of that nature. You know what I'm saying? Now, for Remy to start, for Remy to start booking guys, and it's a legit platform, plus she's a star already. She's Remy. She's a star. You know what I'm saying? I feel like they was looking at it like, oh, okay, there might have been a little bit of tension there, but it really hit the fan when Easy went over there because now you, you're hearing about cease and desist letters being sent and obviously Remy backed easy. That's really where the war started, man. That's really where it started. And I expect nothing less from URL, to be honest with you. Every league is petty. It ain't just them. Every league is petty. Listen, yo, I heard um, Easy Live yesterday, right? And Easy was like, well, actually, it was supposed to be the trenches on the ninth, I believe he said, and, and, and Remy was on the 10th. Like, bro, you think URL was going to let that happen? And they still looking at you like, bro, you broke a contract. Like, bro, y'all are not getting the big picture here. I'm not saying this right, but it's funny. It's funny. They are the machine for a reason. I'm going to sit back and just watch this. You know what I'm saying? Because I look at the big picture here. Well, homecoming coming this weekend. And now you got this. Like, bro, everybody's trying to get the same bread from the same pot. The pot meaning us, the fans. This is why I keep saying... Only the best cards are going to get picked from now on. There's too many pay-per-views. People are spending $300 a month now on pay-per-views because all you leagues keep having them, which I'm not mad at because it's more content. But you got to understand, you are been here forever. They're not going to just sit here and let y'all do. Are y'all crazy? Like, oh, y'all y'all really thought they was going to do that? Especially after the trenches when Easy tried to pull the URL guys over there, which I thought was insane. So I didn't even understand what the big, like, once they, once they got, they left that card, everybody was like, oh, you already pulled the back. Like, I'm looking at it like, why would you even get them on that card? You should have already seen that coming. Like, this is crazy, bro. This is crazy. Now, I already seen the, uh, the prelude. That's the card that's going to have Vixen versus Low Soul and all of that. I already seen that, so I'm not watching it for free. But there's going to be a lot of people who probably are. And they probably will wait for the Chrome battles only because I feel like with, with no coffee and couture, that kind of hurt that card. But with it being Big K versus Jazz, it's just like, whoa, I feel like that battle might have, like that battle supersedes the coffee and 40 to me. So it's still probably worth it. Remy, I, I, it would have been cool if you lowered the card to 35, maybe 40, because you are missing a battle, but whatever. I'm still going to watch it. You know what I'm saying? But I am definitely 
enjoying all of this. I think it is very entertaining. And guess what? This is just the end of 2023. Oh, man, wait till 2024. I don't think y'all understand what's going on here. I really don't. They're going to be getting even pettier next year. So just, you know, relax, kick your feet up and enjoy what's going on, man. Enjoy the content that the media is going to be putting out surrounding all of this mess because it's not going to get better. They're not going to be cool. It is what it is. It is what it is. You know, now, I, like I said, so I'm I'm going to watch the Chrome, but that was an extremely petty move by URL. You know what I'm saying? Now, let's move over to easy to block captain. Woo! Easy to block captain said the trenches is the number one league in Philly. Whoa! Did that catch on fire, boy? What? The algorithm was algorithming when you put that out there, easy. Can't even lie about it. You know what I'm saying? Um, wow. I seen Easy's live for the most part, and Easy was saying how Battle Academy's only been there for a couple of years before the trenches. They ain't been there no 10, 11 years. And he's right. He's right. They had World Battle League. They had uh Crack Liberty Bell. They was around for a little while. That's what Reed Dollars Battle Rosenberg Roy at and whatnot. Um, then they stopped. Um I forgot the other league, but Battle Academy has been holding it down for a long time and they're still doing this shout out to Stiz, you know what I'm saying? I can't get mad at Easy saying he feel like his league is because the energy he brought to, 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 to Bad Rap. See, there's the difference, Easy. The difference was this. If you wasn't even lit the way you was, I don't think the trenches would have took off like that. But with it being Easy's league, I think that changed a lot of things. He brought a lot of energy over there, which was smart, you know what I'm saying? So, But I'm not going to jump out the window and say, they're better than Ballad Academy right now. I, I can't do that. And then I seen News 215 and I seen Top Floor Lut both say they got 20K on the floor. They said, what's up? What we doing? Ballad Academy versus Trenches. I seen it today. Like, whoa, there's a thing about this. Who is battling where? That's the thing about this Philly thing. Where is Kaboom battling? Where is K Walker battling? Who is repping who? Battle Academy has battlers. Who do the trenches have that they can say is home besides Muwap that I know for, for a fact? I know Muwap is trenches. I don't know about anybody else who's like hard body karate trenches. You know what I'm saying? So we got to see how that turns out right there. I'm all for it. I'm pretty sure Stiz, Stiz, you don't lose if y'all have a battle anyway. You do realize that, right? This really helps Battle Academy too. Because now it's not just because more eyes are on the trenches realistically at this present time. So I think it's a good move for y'all to battle each other. You know what I'm saying? I seen Bucks. He was in my live yesterday. He popped up. He said, nah, they want to kill other people first. They don't want the Philly on Philly violence. I understand that. But hey, Easy's the one who put it out there. And then on his live, he backed up why he felt like that. Gotta respect that. It ain't like he said, nah, man, I didn't mean it like that. I was just promoting. Nah, he, he feel like that. He feel like that. And I'm not knocking that. Cause at the end of the day, he built he built the churches from the muscle. Did what he had to do. It's lit. We can't even front. And the way he he described it was actually dope. Also, he said you got the URLs, the king of the dots, the RBEs, the Chromes. He said next to that, he feels like it's trenches. That's why I said I want to see trenches versus bullpen. Now I would put obviously I must I would probably put bullpen over trenches myself. But you know I can't get mad at him feeling like yo we right there as a league owner. You supposed to feel like that. You, I'm going to be real with you. I don't know if Trenches... Hold up. Hold up. Forget I don't know. Trenches isn't past We Go Hard right now. You have to remember that. They're, don't act like We Go Hard's not around. Trenches isn't past them yet. But I like the fact that Easy is waving his flag like we're here now. And we just started. See, We Go Hard has been around for a long time. Bullpen has been around for a long time. Trenches just started. And already the steam is there. But a lot of this has to do with Easy himself being on fire. You know what I'm saying? So let me know what league you think is better as of right now. Battle Rap Academy or the Trenches. Subliminal shots are being thrown. Battlers got money on the floor. They, they want to see who the number one league is, man. I'm for all of this. This is all great content. This is keeping Battle Rap alive, I feel like. um, Don't forget Chrome 23. It's night. If you don't got the money or you're saving the money for the homecoming, then... And you can't watch it, there, there's the prelude. You know what I'm saying? So you got something to do rather than you violating and looking for the bootleg. Because you got to think about it. They're going to complain about that. If you find a bootleg for the Chrome, bro, everybody don't got bread like that. 
Everybody don't got bread like that. Point blank period. And I, I don't know about y'all. I'm not about to miss Mook and Twerk. I'm not. I'm not. See something, man. I'm not. Not for no, not for, um, no, no, no. Homecoming card is better than Chrome card, if you're going to keep it real. But that's only because I feel like at this point, I don't even want to say only because, but a big hit came from Couture and Coffee not battling. And then don't forget you got Queen of the Ring that you got to buy the event. So it's just like, bro, get used to this. Get used to this. I'm not really cool with the, with, with the leads trying to have, uh, uh, battles the same day, making people choose. I'm not, I don't agree with all of that. But I do agree with the back and forth. I do agree with everybody wanting to be number one. As long as the fans don't suffer is where I'm coming from with it. As long as the fans don't suffer. What do I mean by that? Okay, that's like Easy's on fire right now. Me personally, I want to see Easy versus um Tay Rock. I want to see it. I want to see Easy. Well, I can't say Easy and Big K. I want to see Tay Rock versus Big K. I want to see it. I can see it not happening because the league's issues. I think that's whack right there. That's what I think is whack. I think Tay Rock, you need to instead of URL wait wondering about who's number one and all the subliminals, easy is the face of Chrome. Rock, you've been waving that URL flag for wild long. You're the face of them in my opinion. Shout out to Geechee, but he does what he wants to do. You know what I'm saying? So I still feel like it's Tay Rock. Y'all should battle somewhere. Let's just stop playing and battle somewhere. Now whoever wins. Now we can y'all can start talking that yeah my league is better than yours because I just beat the man on your league. You see what I'm saying? Big K is over there repping that RBE flag. Him and Ill Will like there are battles out here where you have the faces of these leagues should be getting down. I feel like that's just what I think, man. You know what I'm saying? Let me know what you think about all this. Do you think URL went too far? You know what I'm saying? Being petty doing the, the prelude. I mean they probably feel like yo they went too far. I don't know, man. What back and easy when when he broke a contract? That's how they feel. So all of this is all. And then on top of that, you still got verb. Verb is still bombing on URL. And and for the record, and I've said this plenty of times. You know what I'm saying? At first, I thought verb was just talking, but I totally see what verb is coming from at this point in time. Verb is like like at first, I thought it was just the max out three stream. He's getting a percentage of it. He's looking at it like, yo, URL did it. So that's money in my pocket. But then I actually listened to one of his lives. And it was just like, oh, he's looking at it like, yo, all these years we asked for a little bit more bread. Y'all kept saying, I don't got it. I don't got it. I don't got it. But yet y'all got money to give Norbs multi-million dollar lawsuit. I can't argue with Verb. I can't argue with Verb. He's not saying nothing wrong there, I feel like. You know what I'm saying? He's not saying nothing wrong there. That, but it's business. It is business. And if you want to be real, Hate Man Holler, uh, Mook, Lux, a couple of artists have been said, yo, they got the bread. They got the bread. So, you know, they've and they stood 10 toes down on that. You know what I'm saying? So I guess this Norm's lawsuit really woke battlers up like, yo, they is caking, caking over there. You know what I mean? So I, I see what Verb is doing. I can't get mad at him, bro, for feeling like that. I think it's crazy he's going as long as he's going on. I ain't going front. You know what I'm saying? I do. Um, he said he ain't even going to be around that much longer. So I, I don't like, this is why I keep asking, is battle rap going to be around when surface here? You know what I'm saying? This is why I keep asking that. Could the verb leave? He's entertaining. How long is Rock going to keep battling? How many battles does Rock even have left? You know what I'm saying? Is Easy still going to be on fire when Surf come back? Like, who's going to be carrying the torch these next couple of years? I've heard Geechee say he was slowing down. I've heard Danny say he was slowing down. So who's going to step up? Once these people slow down, that's my thing about it. Hey, if I'm up though, I'm out. I'll see y'all tonight, man. One.